guys, what's up? Alright, so, I have this pool fence here, right? And it hasn't, it was put up when I was about three. Yeah, and I'm much older now. It's, it's aged quite a bit. It was put up for my safety around the pool, so I wouldn't fall in, obviously. That's why my parents put it up. But, um, my dad and I want to repaint it, and they're probably going to repaint it on their own. And, um, so... This is probably one of the big summer projects I will be doing this summer. Um, and possibly doing some touch-up paint on the um, pool deck and stuff. But looking to just do this whole thing over again. Um, so, I mean, it's, it's pretty rough. It's getting rough. This is an aluminum fence. Um, as you guys can see, this... This stuff right here, this top part especially in places is not looking good, and so it needs it needs a repaint. Like it, in places, see see that looks fine, and then you've got places like right here it looks really bad. So um, what I need to do, guys, is get my air compressor up and going again, take it to a mechanic or something, and get somebody to replace my reed valve. The reed valve was in it, and then we'll have that up and going and. Um, I'll be using my spray paint gun and I'll be doing that. So, I mean, it's really getting chalky. You see, that my other finger shows, my thumb shows it better, but yeah, in places it looks really looks fine. It's shiny in places, but where the sun has gotten to it and touched it, it's pretty bad. So. I don't know guys, that's just something I'm looking into doing probably this summer. It's, it would be a very big job, but the way my dad and I look at it is you could do um, sand two panels in the morning and put a put can, uh, coat of paint on it in the afternoon and then maybe start working on another section and then keep doing that and then you get them all done and then what you gotta do is put another coat of paint on all of them. So. Yeah, anyways, guys, that would be something probably be looking into this summer. Um, probably need to get a few things fixed by somebody who welds, because some of these are cracked, and the welds at the bottom are splitting. Uh, this is obviously a corner piece here, so it's got a little stress on it here. Um, but that don't really make a difference, but yeah, it's... Some of these corner pieces don't, don't look very good, so... Anyways, guys, this is kind of like a summer project that I'm probably going to be taking on because yeah and um, so just need to kind of redo things and um, probably try and uh, bend some of these posts these pieces back I don't know maybe my dad and I will work on it sometime and get this to wear these latch properly instead of having to put a having this piece of wire that's been up here since I was little and we have a pipe over there that keeps those gates shut so it'd probably be a good idea to do that and then these will stay locked um we can lock them and get this replaced probably is what we need to do so yeah anyways guys so that is that and uh yeah so anyways guys let me know what y'all think anyways guys we'll see you guys later and um i will give some more well Anyways, the ankle grinder I have is a Harbor Freight um, drill master, and I want to probably put like a wire cut brush or a wire brush on the bottom of it, and then that'll be really easy to go in between here. It's just got just, yeah, just enough clearance there. Anyways, guys, I don't have anything fancy, but, you know, so, anyways, so, anyways, guys, let me know what you guys think, and uh, we will see you guys tomorrow, yeah, tomorrow, so. Anyways, anyways, guys, see you guys later. Bye.